Hello techies, welcome to Microsoft Power Automate tutorials. In this module, we will learn how to create a flow on mobile. First of all, we'll see two things in this module. One is how to install Power Automate mobile app on your mobile. Another one, we will see how to create a flow on mobile. All right. Now, first of all, we'll see how to install Power Automate mobile app on your phone. So for that, we required Android or iOS or Windows Phone OS, which has been there in your mobile. Along with that, we required Office 365 credentials and uh, push notifications has been enabled on your phone. Now let me switch to my mobile. Now I will show you how to install Microsoft Power Automate with mobile app. So first of all, we'll go to Play Store, search for Microsoft Power Automate. You can see over here, Power Automate Business Workflow Automation. Click on that and install that Power Automate Automation mobile app on your mobile. Click on that. It will take some time to install this app on your mobile. Once successfully installed, you will find that mobile power automate app on your mobile select that so click on get started please provide the username and the password which you are going to use for the web portal for the power automate okay i'm going to give the same credentials over here click on sign in once you have successfully logged in you will get a, a screen like this welcome to microsoft flow Click on continue. It will take some time to you know, get all the flows on your mobile. Now you can see I'm having different different apps like activity, browse, buttons, flows and account. I will explain you one by one about these tabs. Activity is nothing but what are the activities like from the past uh, you know, two days or three days, what are the bots, what are the flows we have run it all the flows you will kind of find it over here you can see yesterday i have a daily run status leave approval forms i have run two days before these are all the flows which have been done successfully so you can get it all these things over here in the feed tab and let me go to approvals you will get all the approvals related uh, notifications over here as of now all the approvals have been completed so that you know you don't find any approvals related information over here now let me go to browse over here, you'll find a lot of templates like services, mobile, button, featured, email, approval, all these things that you will find it as we have seen in the uh, web portal related to the Power Automate, right? You can see all the features are available over here. All the categories related templates, you will find it out over here. Now, we'll talk about the buttons. If you observe, in our previous sessions, we have created one of the instance flow that is day to excel flow we have been created right that one you can find it out over here under the buttons so over here what you can do you can by selecting this one you can go ahead and you can invite the others or share the button link also you can invite or you can share this flow to others mobiles also now when you click on the data to excel you can find it out all this information like you know this is the previous bot which you have which this is the previous flow which I have already created. You have to give your employee name, email ID, and the age. Okay, all right. Now, let me go ahead and let me show you the flows. If you see over here, my flows, you can see under my flows, there's the daily report status. This is not shared across the team so that, you know, it will come under my flows. And there are a the lot of flows which have been shared across the team, right? That is one when a new mail arrives, leave approval flow and the data to excel also i have shared across the team you can find it out all these things under flows now this is the walkthrough of mobile app for the power automate now i will show you how to create a flow by using mobile app click on flows there on the topmost you will find plus symbol click on that over here, there you will find two options. One is create from template, create from blank. So I'm going to select create from template. 
Now here, I'm going to create a flow by using a Twitter to get the notifications, okay? So I'm going to select search for Twitter, click on search. There you will find a lot of templates over here, right? So over here, I'm going to select a template like get a push notification on tweet with a certain keyword. I'm going to select that. So there I'm going to use this template to create my flow, use this template. Please give your credentials to log in into the Twitter and then over here you can find such text. Over here what I'm going to do, I'm going to give some text over here to get the tweet appears, okay. I'm going to give it as Power Automate. And then I'm going to click on done. And once the search has been completed and it will be checked for the number of tweets and then if it is more than 20 tweets then I'm going to get a send notification. If not, then I'm not going to do anything. Okay, this is a small flow that I'm going to create on the uh, Twitter. Now let me go, let me click on create. Now this is, we have saved this. Let me click on done. Now let me go to my flows once again. And there you can see already, get push notification tweet with a certain key. Let me select that. And you can see over here, you have to enable the flow, you can enable that flow, you can edit that flow, you can change the flows, you can see run history also. If you want, you can delete that flow also. Let me switch back to my web portal. Now we will see the flow which we have been created from my mobile has been affected over there or not under web portal. Go to my flows. And there you can see under my flows, you can see get a push notification on tweet with certain key. Let's click on that. You can see all the things. However, you are going to do with the same portal. You can do the same thing by using your mobile app for the Power Automate. I hope you understand how to install mobile Microsoft Power Automate app on your mobile. And also we have seen how to create a flow on mobile by using our mobile Microsoft Power Automate app. Thank you for watching Microsoft Power Automate tutorials. If you have any queries related to this concept, please post them in the comment section. I will see you in the next session. Till then, bye-bye. Have a nice day.